Hello everyone! In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a TikTok Ads account. Now what's different with this account is that you're going to be able to advertise your video or create some specific advertisement video that are going to be different with your regular video. With advertising video, you're going to be the only one who will be able to see it. And if people try to go into your page, they might not be able to find that video, but they'll be able to see the video that looks something like this. And this one's right here is actually a some sort of affiliate video. You can see that it has this yellow basket symbols on the bottom left of the video. And if you're going to create an ads video inside of the yellow basket, the part right there is going to show a sponsored video and it means that that is an ads video that someone's created and you can actually create that kind of video too but all you have to do is create your tiktok ads account now it's also going to be different with your tiktok business account and it might seem a little bit complicated for now but it's very easy to create and i'm going to show you how in this tutorial so first things first, go ahead and go to TikTok slash business. And then you can go ahead and click on sign up. And then it's going to bring you into this ads.tiktok.com. Now through here, you have two options. You can try to create your account with your email, or you can also sign up with your phone number so you can choose on whichever it is you want to use and you also have the options to log in with your own tiktok account if you want but i personally prefer to create a new account for my tiktok business and then connect it into my tiktok so i'm going to use email as my signed up option all right once you've signed up with your preferred ways or preferred options they're going to send you some verification so so i'm going to go ahead and open my email to verify my account all right so this is how the email looks like and if you choose phone number they might send you the code on your phone number so make sure that you have enough credits on your phone to receive the message so i'm going to go ahead and enter this into the tiktok ads next we're going to fill in some information about the business so you can go ahead and insert your business name your website url even though this one is optional so if you don't have websites right now you can just skip this one and then fill in your industry they have a bunch of industries category that you can choose and you can also just type in for example if you want to say retail it will show you the options and then you can go ahead and choose the one that describes your business and then obviously you're going to want to enter the countries and region the currency the time zone and then your phone number so you can go ahead and fill in all of this data once you're done with that, you're going to want to choose on how you will want your bills to be paid. Do you want it to be on automatic payment or do you want it to be on manual payment? And if you don't understand how any of them works, you can just hover your clickers on top of this question mark right here and then you'll be able to see the explanation. So for automatic payment, you will have to link a card to your account and set up automatic payments on a recurring billing date or when you've reached the threshold and then you have to note that you can still make separate manual payments if you choose to use these features as for the manual payment you will be able to manually add balance before running your ads any charges will be deducted from your account balance so you can choose whichever you want i prefer the manual one so i'm going to go ahead and click on that one and then go ahead and click go to ads manager and this is the first thing that you'll be able to see once you got your account created here we got the ads creations option so you can straightly create your ads with two different options the first one is the basic one and then we got the advanced one the only different is with the advanced one you'll be able to get more detailed features when trying it to specify your target audience and stuff like that and for the basic one it's it's just not as specific 
and then at the top right of your screen you'll be able to see your profile and you can also change your language right here and this is the name of my business and then if you want you can go ahead and take a look at how your dashboard looks like so this is the dashboard of your tiktok ads and what can you do here is obviously you'll be able to see updates about your ads once you create it and then you can also take a look at the ads that works the best on your region and you can see that this one is say stop ads that performs really well in the last 30 days and then you can also take a look at the potential audience that you can set as your target market for your business now if you go to campaign you'll be able to see on all of the campaign that you have created and the campaign that you created will show here below here once you create it and then you'll be able to see how it works is it good or is it bad so that you can use this data as consideration whether you will want to continue that campaign or create a new one altogether here if you go to tools you'll be able to see a bunch of options that will help you to divine what kind of marketing strategy you will want to do so you can go ahead and scroll around and try to find some inspiration with the help of this tool so that you'll be able to create an ad or a campaign that will work really well here on the analytics section so you'll be able to see the in-depth data or the in-depth analytic of your campaign so they got custom reports in which you can actually create on your own so if you would like to create some report consisting of several things that you feel are the most important you can definitely create your own custom reports and then they have attributions analytic they have audience insight comments insight creative inspiration and then some video insights again these are the tools or the things that will be able to help you to create a better ads for your business now let's try and take a look on how you can create ads if you did not create it right after you got your account so you can go ahead and go to campaign and then click on create and then they're going to bring you into the exact same page that we got the first time we created our account so let's say that i want to go with basic ones for now so go ahead and click on basic and then you're going to want to choose on your advertising goal so they have traffic they have community interaction they have lead generation they have website conversion and then they have sales product online let's say that for now i still want to focus on my traffic i want people to be able to discover me i want to focus on gaining more audience so traffic is going to be the one that i choose and then go ahead and click on continue and here you'll be able to set on the audience now you can actually choose just all for the demographic or the interest and behavior and then let the data got specified from there but if you already have a specific target market on mine settings on the exact demographic as well as the interest and behavior is going to be super helpful so that you know this ads will reach the right person yes it's going to reduce the audience size and i'm going to show you let's say that for the demographic i want the gender to be just female as you can see the audience size already reduced and maybe i want to focus on the female at the age of 18 to 24 and 25 to 34 and then for the languages i'm just going to choose all you can see that the audience size definitely changed than if i use all as my demographic but again choosing the right audience for your ads is going to be super helpful and you will be able to get return faster than if you just randomly spread your ads to unknown person and once you're done selecting your audience you can go ahead and click on continue and set your budget so you can choose whether you want your budgets to be set on daily basis or if you would like to add a lifetime budget they do have a minimum amount of money that you will have to pay if you choose lifetime budget so again for this part you can just explore which one works the best for you and then you can also set on when you want the ads to be run whether it's for a month or a week 
it totally depends on how long you want this ads to run so let's say that i'm just going to follow what the system gives me which is around a month i believe and then i'm going to go ahead and click on continue and here is the part where you want to create your ads so you can choose one of the video that you have posted on tiktok as your ads or you can just upload your own video by clicking on this symbols right here and then go ahead and click on upload video once you're done with that you can continue and then start creating your campaign that you can manage and see the progress on this campaign sections right here and that's basically it that is how you can create and open a tiktok ads account i hope this tutorial is helpful for you thank you so much for watching and have a great day